guys, this is Jari Applier. Welcome to this video where I'm gonna be answering some questions people sent me on Instagram. What direction do you think your channel will go? Reactions, skits, vlogs, etc. Um, well, now I focus more on reactions because I found out a way to edit them as good as possible thanks to an app I found. Um, I honestly just do what I want to do, like I tried the Sour Patch Kids one, This is that was something I wanted to try out. The reactions I thought it would be cool to see my very first reaction on a video, um, so I um, started with that. And actually I'm not sure, um, maybe I'll focus on the reactions. But vlogs? Hmm. Vlogs? Nah, I think I'll uh, continue on with the reactions if I if I find if I find some videos um, that I want to react to. When did you start this fan page? Uh, my fan page on Instagram. I started that one on January twenty eighteen. Actually, it was not long ago. Two years. And yeah, I just, um, my first upload was on Halloween, was it Halloween 2018? I think so. I started it in January 2018 and then I started uploading on Halloween 2018. There was just um, some, some edits, some picture edits I made in the past and then I then I think in March or so, 2019, I started with the whole clips, with cutting out, cutting out some good clips and posting that, and I'm glad it came out really well. And now I just I, I like putting them on Instagram, some some clips or something if I found some good ones. It's it's cool. It's really nice. What would you do if your ch YouTube channel gets big? My YouTube channel big. Come on. I mean, others worked really hard also to get this get their channel big, but me? I just, um, I don't know. I don't think my channel will be big. Not yet. Um, pro um, not yet, I think. If it goes big, it will probably take some years. <laughs> because I'm, hell no, I'm really no expert on anything. I just record with my good old phone camera and um, then download the original video and then put it in an app and that was it. Just some editing, some cutting. I'm, I'm no expert like uh, some YouTubers that got millions of subscribers. Um, but if my channel gets big, I don't, I don't know. Um, my YouTube channel would get big, um, probably first I would have a, a nice office, not like my room I have right now, like a real good office, um, yeah, the right equipment, I would love to go to some conventions and travel a little, but... That will probably take some really long years. I, I, at least not yet. I think my channel will grow that big. <laughs> Who do you watch more? Put. I don't know what you meant there. Why you um, wrote put in there? Of Sean and Mark. Maybe you mean uh, like um, out of Mark and uh, Jack. And I really can't tell. It depends. Like. Um, they upload their videos um, differently. Sean sometimes do, does that with two videos a day. If he doesn't feel like it, just one video a day, which is probably just totally fine. And Mark um, mostly has one video per day and his now Unus Anus videos with Ethan. With Ethan. My, my goddamn mouth. <laughs> That's that's the problem with me. I'm not a native English speaker. Um, 
But who do I watch more? I can't tell. It really depends. Like when I got some free time and there's nothing on TV, I just um, watch a video randomly. Sometimes more of Jack, sometimes more of Mark. It really depends. I'm not sure who I watch more because I love them both. Jack or Mark. And I can't decide. I love them both. I'm a really big fan of both. And you can't make me choose, man. You can't make me choose between them. I love my boys. Do you like Panic at the Disco? Yeah, I do. I do. I'm not a hardcore fan of the band, but I really like some uh, songs of them. Like, I know a few songs thanks to YouTube and I really enjoyed them. So I enjoy their music, let's say it that way. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much do you love Jack's videos? Is that even a question? <laughs> Is that even a question? Is that even a question? <laughs> uh, on a scale of 1 to 10, I would say a hundred or a million because I love this video so much. <laughs> but if you want to be serious, it will be a 10. When did you first start watching Jacksepticeye and Markiplier? I can tell you that um, I first started watching Mark. It was in November 2015. Thanks to, I think, his uh, Five Nights at Freddy's series because FNAF was really popular. It still was, I think, uh, I don't know if the third game was released in uh, November 2015, but I think so. And I was there like, what? what is FNAF? YouTube is full with Five Nights at Freddy's and everyone talk about that. What even is that? And I searched for it on YouTube and found Mark's Let's Play and I started watching it and I really loved that guy. <laughs> I really enjoyed the Let's Play and so I uh, subscribed to him and a few months later, it was in April 2016, I found Jack, um, thanks to Mark, because of a collab uh, Let's Play. I don't know, maybe it, was, maybe it was Prop Hunt or something like that, but I found him thanks to Mark. So, that, so it had a little connection. I first found Mark, November 2015. And then April 2016, I found Jack. And I still love him uh, since that year. Since I found them. Are you best friends with Jack and or Mark? Oh, buddy, I wish. <laughs> Sadly, no, I'm not. But I wish. I mean, I watched both of them live. You can see the poster there and the other poster there. But uh, no. Sadly, I'm not best friends with them. That's still a big wish of mine, like uh, having contact with them or just being friends with them. C collabing in a video or something or to be just a guest on a video or something like that. But nowadays, I still believe that won't happen. Even though I watched them live, I, uh, I thought before like, oh, they will never go to my country, never. And then... You're welcome to her. How do we get here to her? They got on. They got. Um, they came in my country. They were very great evenings. I really enjoyed Mark's show. I really enjoyed Jack's show. I even got to meet Jack um, for a short time after the show. Got to hug him. His hug was so warm and nice. Um, got to make a selfie with him. The cap is thanks to the You're Welcome Tour. I, that's my, one of my very first merch I got, plus the t-shirt and jacket. Um, yeah, <laughs> but uh, but sadly I'm not friends with both. They, I don't think they even know me, e uh, at least Mark. Mark doesn't know who I am or something. I mean, I, met, I saw him live, but I didn't meet him or anything. I hadn't met him. Uh, I just saw him live, but and he probably don't know who I am. And if Jack remembers me um, when I sh shortly met him after the tour, that's great. I would freak out if he mentioned me like, "Oh, you're the girl I met um, after the show. You uh, you were with other fans and something." 
yeah, I would freak out, but I'm not sure if he still remembers that. Maybe because it was 2018, but yeah, I would just wish to be their friend. Um, that's one of my wishes, really. <laughs> the last question is, when is your birthday? Well, here it comes, my birthday reveal. <laughs> If you may believe me or not, but my birthday is on the 25th of December. <laughs> yeah, my birthday is on Christmas Day. <laughs> is, it, is it believable? Do you believe me when I say that? But it's true, I... Yeah, my birthday is on Christmas Day, but that doesn't mean it's great or anything. My past birthdays were actually not that great because it's Christmas, everyone is at their with their families no one ever wants to go to my birthday because they either go on vacation or celebrate christmas with their family and my past school time wasn't that great anyway so um uh the first the only person who mostly came to my birthday was my cousin and just my family so uh yeah and it's not like, it's not like, uh, oh, Christmas Day. Now you get double presents because we celebrate Christmas also on Christmas Eve. Like we have Christmas Eve. We celebrate that as Christmas. We get presents on Christmas uh, on uh, the 24th uh, too. Um, um, before it was like, oh, you get two presents uh, a day like on the 24th you get presents and then on the 25th and uh, nowadays it isn't like that it's like we get you a present but you decide if you open it on the 24th or the 25th so it's not like uh, oh I get presents for Christmas and my birthday no I get presents for like one day either Christmas or my birthday <laughs> um, I mean, it's a it's a cool day to think about. It's like Christmas Day, or it's like a special, it's like a holiday and everything. But and I, I I'm also happy to um, I'm not mad or something that I have my birthday on Christmas Day or anything. I still think it's cool. But um, yeah, it's. It still sucks that um, not many people could go to my birthday in the past, and that was probably also because I didn't had didn't have any friends in school or anything. Like I said, my school time was horrible, but let's not talk about that, shall we? <laughs> this was supposed to be a good time. So that was all. That were all the questions I had. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, thank you all. Uh, thank you for the questions also. And yeah, maybe maybe someday, someday maybe I'll do another one. I'm not sure. I can't promise it now. But yeah, let's see. So thank you all, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.